Thank you, thank you. It's good to be here. I have been uh, homeless numerous times during my career, uh, mainly because of my career. Um, <laughs> but uh, anyone, anyone can be homeless. You know, even, a, even a talented stand-up comedian with gorgeous blue eyes that are absolutely to die for. Um, <laughs> Obviously, being homeless doesn't mean that, you, that you're sleeping on the street. Uh, you can also sleep uh, in a car that's parked on the street. <laughs> so there's a difference. There's various reasons uh, people get into homelessness. Uh, I've had a few. Uh, financial hardship, uh, escaping an abusive relationship, um, and the big one, substance abuse. Surprise! <laughs> Uh, not the good stuff, though, not the good stuff. Not Tom Ballard, so... <laughs> um, but I have quit some heavy shit over the years. I've quit heroin, crystal meth and voting Labor. So <laughs> I've made some positive changes in my life. Um, the hardest thing to quit, though, is showbiz. Cos there's no business like show business. <laughs> Prostitution comes to mind. Um, but there's a romance to being a homeless artist uh, until you're bathing in a public toilet sink. Um, yeah, now, Hitler was a homeless artist and he turned out all right, so... <laughs> yes. But the industry is tough. The industry is very tough. One minute you're a peacock, the next minute you're a feather duster. The next minute, you're Tom Ballard, you know? <laughs> it can go goes ups and downs. Uh, so one time, this, this big-name act in the UK asked me to support him at the Edinburgh Festival for 30 nights in a 400-seat theatre at £15 a ticket. Now, I'm not great at maths, but that's over a 1000 bucks, right? <laughs> and I go, well, how much are you going to pay me? And he goes, £400. I'm like... £400 a night for a month? <laughs> I made it! I started Googling yachts, right? Now, at the time, I, I worked as an audience warm-up at uh, Australia's Got Talent and, uh, because you've got to eat. Um, and, I, uh, and I was like, hey, Grant Denyer, the survey says, get fucked! Um, <laughs> And uh, off I went for Edinburgh. Hooray for Hollywood. Um, turns out the 400 pounds was for the month. Yeah, yeah. So I've come back to Australia completely destitute and I've gone back to Grand Tenure and I'm like, um, sorry, mate, the, uh, the survey was wrong. Um, I, think what, I think what happened there was... It's just a little bit of a family feud. Um, but uh, thank you. That's uh, the best joke in the set. Um, uh, anyway, Grant is, is honestly the most loveliest guy in the world you, you could ever meet. Somebody should give him a, an award of some description. Um, but he's like, no worries, mate. Look, my wife and I have a spare bedroom at our house. Would you like to come and stay with us? And I was like... The survey says, oh, fuck yeah. <laughs> um, now, I've been lucky enough uh, to have been looked after by some wonderful people over the years, and I'm eternally grateful to them. But sometimes when you're homeless, you'd rather spend that small amount of money that you do have on a bed in a hostel or a decent meal or a substance that'll numb the pain. Because the burden of being an imposition on someone, especially someone you love, is hard to bear. Now, the good thing is, that now the feud's been cancelled, I'm able to return the favour. <laughs> and Grant and his family are staying at my house now, so... 